Hey everybody, welcome to another video where we're going to talk about something. Let's try to have a focus here um, about Windows. Welcome to the tech channel. And uh, I'm in a beautiful place here, by the way. Look at that. It's kind of a water fountain. And it's very, very beautiful all around, including the ceiling. It's uh, the uh, International Business Center of Montreal. Very, very beautiful. And what's nice? It's like they built a building surrounding older buildings. So we've got the older buildings with, you know, the old style of building from the time, and including even, you know, when we look here, these are part of old buildings. Um, and they've created some uh, business spaces all around here. With that, there's also like a Michelangelo or something in the back here with a fountain and everything. It's kind of interesting when you think about it. So I wanted to talk about tomorrow. Tomorrow will be a patch Tuesday. So that means that tomorrow we will have some security updates that will arrive. Uh, we'll have to take a look at that. And of course, tomorrow uh, there's going to be a lot of videos posted uh, considering that uh, it's patch Tuesday. So we'll look at the security updates. And also what we are wondering is for uh, users of the April 2018 update, um, what will um, what will there be in there uh, concerning, um, you know, fixes maybe, some kind of fixes that we'll, uh, we'll have. And uh, we're really wondering about that because, I mean, this is... Uh, after all, April 2018 update seems to be buggy, and we're wondering, and will Microsoft issue some uh, interesting fixes in there? That's, gonna, that, that, that's one of the questions for tomorrow. And of course, uh, we'll be following every little detail of that update tomorrow. Uh, one of the things also about tomorrow's update um, is what will there be as critical updates that we need to uh, check out. So that's another little thing here. So sorry about the sunshine that sometimes makes the image a little... Because I want to show you guys a little something. There'll be a little treat at the end of the video. So this is a very beautiful, beautiful center, by the way. Um, so, you know, uh, considering the problems, we'll see if there's a certain number of, uh, of fixes. Will those fixes actually fix some of the issues that we've seen? Because... Um, we're kind of a little surprised that uh, in the month of May, the first cumulative update really didn't fix much. The cumulative update basically did just little fixes here and there. We had a small cumulative update, which is a manual update for those with uh, uh, solid state drives and, and other little you know, details. But honestly, for an operating system that we uh, see rolling out with so many problems, I can't... I can't see why there's no bigger updates and bigger fixes in there. So that's something we're going to have to check tomorrow uh, for sure. And uh, here is uh, the little, uh, little, uh, here, look at that, guys. This is an actual piece of the Berlin Wall. So this is history, guys. History in the making. So this is one side. And, uh, of course, we have the uh, other side here with all the details of this piece of history. And uh, for some reason, uh, because of all the people and everything that happened uh, with this symbol, I always, uh, always want to touch. You know, here's my hand. Too many people died and too many, uh, too many people suffered for... Uh, what is probably one of humans or humanity's uh, big nightmares. And, you know, and we're continuing anyways. We're continuing to do more of those. So anyways, uh, we'll see what tomorrow's updates bring uh, with Windows and uh, see, uh, apart from the security updates, what other updates we'll get. So here's going outside. And, you know, I showed you a tunnel last week. If you guys watched the video, there was a tunnel that was going far away. It's actually the tunnel that actually arrives right here from down here. So it uh, gives you guys an idea. 
And of course, here there's one of the big hotels for businessmen, Intercontinental, which is like $200. I think the least expensive, like $250 a night. And, uh, well, look, if you can see, it's a very beautiful, very beautiful place. And very, very quiet. And actually, what I like to do when I'm here is go to the, uh, the second cup, get myself a latte. And there's like these big chairs that you can actually sit in. And I'll be doing that. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.